Welcome to Beer Barbecue Baseball. I have with me today a India Pale Ale from Cigar City Brewery. Cigar City Brewing, sorry. Um, they're out of Tampa Bay, Florida. Um, I've seen this around uh, the St. Louis area. Um, haven't tried it yet, but I'm out of town now and thought, what the heck, I'll try it. It's in a, a variety 12 pack, so what a better reason to get it and try the other ones that I haven't seen. So, um, date on the can is 5-10-2019, and it is currently June 25th. Wow, um, 2019. So, let's get into the beer. Ooh. It's a nice looking head. I can smell the citrus from here. It smells delightful. And I see quite a bit of sediment floating around in there. I'm not getting anything in the camera, but there is all kinds of sediment floating around. Um, it can't be old, so it's gotta be It's gotta be some orange peel or something. Mm, it does smell delightful. Let's see here. Man, man, this smells fantastic. I'm getting some kind of uh, orange. It smells, <clears throat> it smells fantastic. I'm getting some malts on there too. A lot of citrus. Nice head, heads hanging around there for a while. This beer is um, 70 IBUs, and it is 7.5% um, uh, alcohol by volume. So I'm expecting this to be bitter, although it smells super fruity and citrusy. But let's get into it and find out. Hmm. Wow. That foam. I should say that head is a great start to this beer it's super creamy not like your regular foam on a beer it is it is fantastic it's like uh, the beginning of an ice cream float you get that creaminess that's exactly what this is, or not what this is, but exactly what it tastes like. And the sediment is still, it's just laying around in there. I wish you could see it. The taste is fantastic. Whoa, this does not taste like it's seven and a half percent alcohol. Look at the lacing. It's a good looking beer and it tastes fantastic. This is super easy to drink. This is a beer that would get you in a lot of trouble real quick because it tastes so good. And that foam again, that foam is just, 
I've never I've never experienced anything like that before in a beer. It's super delightful. Sorry, I'm I'm facing the window. So the light is like super bright in here. I wish it, I wish you could see the sediment. I mean, it's all over the place. This is a, a great beer. I'm going to tell you, this is probably my new favorite beer to drink. I'm going to give it a four and a half. Excuse me. A four and a half out of five. If you've had this, let me know what you think. I think it's fantastic. It doesn't taste like a juice bomb. It does finish kind of bitter. It smooths out. I mean, it kind of leaves like a like an orange peel taste on the back of your tongue. It's phenomenal. Um, I'd almost consider giving it a higher score, but I'm going to go with a four and a half. I almost want to let this sit for a minute and see if I can get some different aromas in out of it. But I don't want to let you guys hang on here that long. I'm already going over usually what I like to be done around five, five and a half minutes, so. But this is a fantastic beer. If you can get it, I highly recommend it. Again, four and a half out of five. Super citrusy. Finishes with a dry, malty citrus taste in the back end. After you swallow, that lingering orange peel hangs out there on the tongue for a while. Uh, it's great. Give it a shot if you can find it. Again, it's High Lai um, India Pale Ale from Cigar City Brewing out of Tampa, Florida. Um, I can get this in St. Louis. I'm in Indiana currently. I've seen it in a couple different places now. Go grab you a six pack, 12 pack, mix of 12, whatever. If, it, if you see this beer in there, grab it. Highly recommend it. Thanks for watching. Leave me some comments, tell me what you think, and we'll talk to y'all later.